For chemical reactions, we can summarize the interaction between kinetics and thermodynamics, catalysis, and energy differences between products and reactants. So let's do that. For a typical chemical reaction that's exothermic, where the reactants are higher in energy than the products, what we find is that the reverse activation energy is greater than the forward activation energy. That means the reverse reaction for an exothermic chemical reaction is more temperature sensitive. This rate will react to a temperature change more dramatically than the forward rate. If I look at an endothermic chemical reaction where the reactants are lower in energy than the products and I have to absorb energy overall to proceed, then the forward reaction is the temperature sensitive or higher activation energy reaction. So endothermic, forward reaction is temperature sensitive. Now, let's look at the effect of a catalyst. Here's the, both reactions under the effect of a catalyst. A catalyst lowers activation energies. It doesn't change the thermodynamics. So addition of a catalyst, the activation un energy under the effect of a catalyst lower than without the catalyst. So, Catalysts reduce activation energies, but they do not change the thermodynamic relationship between the products and the reactants. So you can run a catalyzed chemical reaction, and the same amount of energy will be released or absorbed when that reaction proceeds. So this is a summary of the thermodynamic and kinetic variables in a chemical reaction.